guys welcome to a new vlog today I thought I would do a what I eat in a day because it has been a while since I filmed one of these and I have had a few requests for it it is Friday morning and uh, I had just made myself some oats which is what I eat every single morning it's nothing very exciting it's very simple to make so basically what I do is I put my oats in and I don't measure them I just kind of pour in how much I think and then I add a teaspoon of brown sugar a very generous teaspoon of peanut butter and then I put water in there and I just put enough water in there to make sure it's still slightly creamy I put it in the microwave for two minutes and then after that I add some almond milk the one that I use is this one here it's called Nutty Bruce almond and coconut milk I prefer this over just a straight almond milk and then I mix it all together and this is what I end up with I also have an iced coffee today now this is actually a decaffeinated coffee hang on one second let me just grab the beans so I can show you so I've been trying this brand out recently it's called stratus coffee and basically it's coffee without the caffeine uh, which i kind of prefer i find i get anxiety and i find if i have coffee it actually makes me really anxious however i like the whole process of having a coffee as part of my morning routine i know when i film my morning routine i got so many questions asking me where is the coffee uh, and that's kind of why i find if i'm really stressed out it just only adds to the stress rather than making me feel better so I'm having a bit of an iced coffee. Again, I've used the um, Nutty Bruce and um, I've just made it in, yeah, you can hear Nigel drinking water outside. <laughs> um, so yeah, yeah, it tastes really good. So I have found, because I've made it a few times now, that it's actually a really, really strong and flavorful kind of bean. So I tend to prefer something that's a little bit milder. So I'm kind of, I guess, experimenting with how many beans I grind up when I'm actually making a um, batch of coffee. So that is what I'm having for breakfast. I'll check in with you guys a bit later on. It's about five past 12 now. I've just actually been spending part of my morning going through my wardrobe again. I'm having this real obsession over it and there are a few things that I was a little bit on the fence with. So I was taking photos, writing up descriptions and I popped all of those on my TikTok store. I'm now feeling really hungry. I haven't had tea or anything. It is pouring down with rain outside. So I'm not really that thrilled about needing to go outside at all. I do need to go to the Apple store later this afternoon because I managed to break my laptop. Uh, I decided to try and downgrade from Mojave to High Sierra and I think I deleted my entire operating system. So need to go and get that repaired. Uh, I thought I'd maybe just show you guys my outfit then I'm going to talk you through what I'm planning on having for lunch. So the accessories are pretty simple. I've just got some earrings on from Pandora. I am wearing my Missima Interstellar necklace which I have been loving and then I've just got my linear watch on. The t-shirt that I am wearing, this is an old one. You guys will have seen me wearing this quite a few times I'm sure it's from Brandy Melville and have to say um, it's held up pretty well I mean the quality of it isn't fantastic I don't think I'd probably go there again for teas but I love the color the fit everything so it's staying in my wardrobe my skirt is fitted so I kind of like to balance proportions so this is from tea by Alexander Wang and it's just one of those sort of bubbly hem skirts you can kind of change the way that that sits then on my feet, I'm just wearing my ATP Atelier sandals. I've been really enjoying wearing those. So here you go. This is a look at the full outfit today. Now let's get in the kitchen so I can make something to eat because like I said, I am ravenous. Alright, so for lunch today, I'm going to go for something vegetarian. So I'm going to have some roasted vegetables with quinoa and probably a bit of feta and some greens. Really simple. Um, I've really been enjoying roasting up some pumpkins. So I've got some here that I bought uh, earlier in the week. So I'm going to cut them into slices, pop it in the oven probably for about 45 minutes, I think. Um, and then I'm just going to put the quinoa on and I like to put a little vegetable stock in there just because I think it gives it a bit of flavor. So I'm going to get onto that. Actually, I also might have a carrot with some, uh, what's it called? It's this chickpea dip. Let me grab it. Okay, I've got two carrots here. They're quite skinny this week. I went and did some groceries last night and I don't know, all of the carrots they had were really small ones. Uh, so this is a vegan spicy red hummus. Can you guys read this? Vegan spicy red hummus. So yeah, it's got a really nice flavor to it. Uh, really punchy and it's 
so tasty. I can eat it all on my own. So yeah, I'm gonna eat those with this, make my lunch, and I'll check in with you guys again soon. All right, so here is a look at my lunch. So I've got quinoa underneath all of the veggies, then I've added in some mixed lettuce, some baby tomatoes, sauerkraut. I actually ended up roasting some carrots in addition to the pumpkin, and then I've got some feta in the center. I love this sort of thing, and seeing so much color in my meal, it always makes me really happy. So yeah, looking forward to tucking into this. I am so hungry. It's 3.30 now and I thought I would have a nice block. It's really hot outside, it's quite a muggy day. We've had a number of thunderstorms and stuff like that rolling through, so uh, anything to help me keep cool is very much needed right now. Uh, I have just gotten back home from the city. Uh, Apple were able to fix my laptop, thank goodness. So very thrilled, I've just gotta set it back up again and I'll be up and running, which is nice. Uh, and I'm just gonna crack on to a bit more work. Um, it's kinda nice because the whole year is sort of starting to wrap up now. Yeah, it's gonna be good, but I'm gonna enjoy my ice block now. It's tasty. It sort of sounds like it's about to storm. Mm, mm, it's really good. And um, I'll see you guys probably at dinner time. It's 6.30 now and I'm feeling a bit peckish so I'm going to have something to eat for dinner. I'm not actually going to do anything flashy or exciting. I feel like I've eaten a lot of rich food this week so I'm actually just going to have some avocado on toast which is so basic, so lazy but it's kind of what I feel like. I'm the kind of person who if I don't know what to eat, avocado on toast is always sort of my number one go-to. So I'm going to have that and I'm going to have the rest of the pumpkin that I roasted at lunchtime as well. I might maybe have a little bit of feta with that too. So yeah, it's going to be a very basic, simple meal. Last night for dinner um, and the previous night actually, we had a really beautiful bolognese with pasta, but um, I always find it's really, really rich for me. So every time I have that afterwards, I kind of feel like I want to eat something a little bit lighter. Um, and then I'm probably going to chop up some melon to have for dessert afterwards, I think. It's just me at home for dinner tonight because Luke is out for his work Christmas do. So I won't see him until a bit later on this evening when he gets home. So yeah, um, I'm going to make that. I'll show you guys what it looks like. It's not going to be anything glamorous. <laughs> uh, and then I think I'll probably wrap up this video. Okay, so as I mentioned, really simple. Here I've got the rest of the pumpkin, my avocado on toast. So I'm going to tuck into this. I also just wanted to quickly sign off and say thank you guys so much for watching this video as always. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed getting to see a little bit of some of the types of foods that I tend to eat on a day to day basis. And I will see you guys in a couple days time with a new video. See you soon. Bye.